Hi, Cancer. I'm sorry I was doing your uh, love reading and uh, I got cut off. And so I'm just starting it over again. Remember, these are general. They're not going to resonate with all of you. Um, but because I pulled the cards already, I just left them here. Okay. Um, and the cards that I got coming up for your partner is the five of arrows, frustration, the 10 of bows, and the hooded man. So what I'm clearly getting from this is that there's been some frustration in this connection and it's been weighing heavily on them and they've been doing a lot of thinking about it, okay? Um, for others of you, I feel like this person is actually going through a lot of stress and maybe they've been acting out of character, withdrawing, or having a lot of work and burdens on them and it's been frustrating them and they're trying to figure out a way out of it. Now, because these are general and you're not all involved with the same person, I have to clarify this to tell you that there's two different feelings I'm getting. Some of you, you've been frustrated with them and, and you, there's separation that's been going on between the two of you and it's been really weighing heavy on them. They're trying to find out, they're trying to figure out a way to contact you and rectify the situation. Others of you, this person has just been going through it, okay? These two cards are going through it and they've been trying to figure out a way out of it. Now the card that I picked up for how they see you was the green man. And this is a very powerful card. This is a very powerful person that can see into things. That's very psychic, that has the ability to, to uh, of prophecy, of insight. But really you add balance to them. You make them feel balanced is what I'm getting from this. This person balances the masculine and the feminine energy. And so whatever, your partner, your partner sees you as somebody, as a conduit to their peace, their happiness, their comfort. You support them. You're very strong force for them. And they find, feel very secure in, in your connection, okay, is what I'm getting right now. But let's take a look and see what is the, oops. All right, so there's been some imbalance going on here and they've been really weighing the pros and the cons of the situation. And they've been very sad about this separation. So some of you are in separation, this person, and they've been mourning it. Some of you are mourning it too, because you've been sad about separation, but I'm telling you, it's not as a result of them not feeling it for you or wanting it with you. It's a result of them being really stressed out with a lot of things, or at least frustrated with the with the fact that this relationship has been going through the struggles and they're trying to figure out a solution because they see you as the green man which is absolutely somebody that is desirable that brings them balance that makes them happy that nurtures them that cares for them that has a nurturing vibe and a feeling okay but they've been very sad about stuff um, some of you it's been something they did they weren't giving you what what you needed with this injustice this means that things were unbalanced and they're sad about it, but with the great bear, it's like they need to leave their baggage at the door and move forward, okay? The great bear is judgment. They've been thinking about how they screwed up, okay? They've been thinking about how they screwed up, they're sad about it, and they wanna bring balance back to this connection, okay? That's what they ultimately wanna do. Now, how have you been feeling? Oops. Now, you really feel a strong connection with them, but some of you may be feeling like there's a lack of respect coming in on their end. Maybe they're not calling you when they should. They're not following through. Um, you know, and I feel like a lot of you right now are really about respect. You definitely have a good chemistry. You get along really well. You, you, you do feel like a very powerful connection with them, but there's a lack of respect and you're not having it. <laughs> You want respect, you are demanding respect, and that's how you feel about this connection. Now, I do feel like they are going to step up because they feel bad. They're, they're kind of going through judgment right now about the loss of you or the end of the connection or thinking about it. And you're like not tolerating it. You just, you really are about getting that respect. Even though you have a very strong connection, you need to have somebody on the same page and like minds. I do see them coming through their challenges and their difficulties. For some of you, it's an air sign, an Aquarius, Libra, or Gemini, sun, moon, or rising. They're gonna be stepping into their power and their confidence, and they're gonna wanna come back and restart things with you, okay? I definitely see that as communication coming through. I do see them um, 
dealing with the realizing that they haven't been giving the right balance. And it's really because you're like this. You're like, you're standing your ground. Okay, you're, you, you want that respect, you're demanding that respect, and they're gonna step up as a result of it. So I hope that you guys found this helpful. Um, if you did, don't forget to give it a thumbs up. Thank you so much for joining me. And um, if you like a personal reading, you can visit my site at www.alumastrology.com. And otherwise, uh, oh, you can email me too at um, alumastrology at gmail.com. All right, you guys, thank you so much. Until next time.